Mr. Speaker, last week I was grateful to join Senator Tom Cotton from Arkansas to introduce a bill which would stop the President from circumventing Congress by signing the U.S. into the Comprehensive Nuclear Test Ban Treaty without the required Senate approval. This legislation is clear. Matters related to nuclear deterrence and national security should be the job of Congress and not an unaccountable international body. This is the basis for preserving peace through strength to protect American families. That's why the legislation pledged to defund the Comprehensive Test Ban Treaty Organization Preparatory Commission if the President relinquished sovereignty over testing of nuclear weapons, putting American families at risk of attack. Just days after introducing the legislation, the UN Security Council approved a meaningless resolution that merely encourages all nations to so sign the ban on nuclear testing weapons around the world. This bill reinforces the Senate's constitutional authority to approve all international treaties. In conclusion, God bless our troops and may the President by his actions never forget September 11th and the global war on terrorism.